What is going on guys? Welcome back to SC Outdoors. Uh, this is a part two of this day of fishing. Uh, this morning I decided to hit a couple of native brook trout streams. The first video of the day was the first stream that I, I hit. Um, caught a bunch of small fish, nothing, uh, nothing over probably like five or six inches. So I moved to a different stream. This stream is a class A wild trout creek, which in Pennsylvania means that it is pretty high quality water. Um, there is higher density of fish here. Um, than your average average stream so I'm hoping that means just with the high water quality lots of fish there might be a, a bigger fish sitting here or there uh, it is not stocked at all so no holdovers it'll be all native brook trout hopefully uh, so anyways let's uh, let's get to it part two of this little Appalachian trout day start now Got him. Yes. Came up and whipped at it a few times, but finally got it. So that didn't take very long. What that water's cold. There we go, first rookie of the day. I'm gonna try to stick him back in where he was. Back in there. There he goes. Awesome, good stuff. Ooh, that's a good one. Got him, yes. Oh uh, no, that was a, such a pretty fish. Oh man. Wish I could have landed him. I wonder if he knew he was hooked. I see him still sitting there. No chance he bites out again, right? Oh, he's going after it. Got stuck over that tree though. So he must not have got hooked because he's still kind of into it. Let me see if I can get him to bite. So where'd he go? Shoot. I don't know where he got to. I thought I might be able to get him. He's a really pretty fish. Very red. Wish I could have got him in there. Well, it's, this is a good sign. This is a good sign. Like this. Little guy. Very little fish. Let's see if I can crowd him here. Look at this guy. Oh, there he goes. So tiny. Deep pool, there's gotta be a better fish in there. There we go. Ooh, this is a pretty fish. He's got a good red on him. Still haven't seen one as pretty as that one I lost earlier, unfortunately. But this guy's got some good colors, for sure. So you can see the nice reds on him. Very cool.
There we go. There's a few in there, four or five at least. Unfortunately, I lost the bigger one. But this little guy will do. No matter how small, brook trout are so cool. I wish I could get a good one though, like a big one. Cause there's nothing better than a brightly colored big brook trout. Oh man, get out of town. But hopefully we'll find one. We're not gonna be fishing too much longer, but we'll see. There we go. There's a fish. Probably gonna be the last fish of the day. Oh, and he came off. That's fitting. He just ran into my foot, wherever he is. Uh, and that's probably gonna do it. I walked pretty far, so I'm probably gonna head back. It's getting close to dark. But fun day chasing some brookies. Uh, it's been a while since I've gone out, you know, specifically for some brook trout out in the mountains up here, so. Uh, but ton of fun. I wish I could have found at least one bigger one. That one I lost earlier, man. That fish was good. I'm um, from this creek anyways, and it had a had great coloring. I wish I could have landed him, but oh well, it is what it is. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe, and I will see you next time on FC Outdoors.